still have a Lexus? What's up? How you doing? What's up, cowboy? Turn left up here. Oh, I see what I'm doing. Completely going the wrong way. delivering to a Lufkin, Lufkin, Texas. And we started out in Dallas is where we're at now. So Cowboy, all Fanatec. Fanatec Club Sport V2. Fanatec Podium DD2 for the hub. I'm sorry, the wheelbase. And then the rim I bought on Amazon. often do I flight sim? It's been a while. I do have to make some time to stream that. I was going to try to squeeze in some evening streams for flight. hard to do it during the day because when I do, whoops, everybody looking for trucking is, you know, disappointed. What's up, brick wall? So, Frankie, you can use a console in a racing sim or a driving flight sim, not this particular game. This game is console only, American Truck Simulator. And we are hauling... What's up, gamer? How you doing? Uh, 
weekend was so-so. A lot of pain this weekend from what I thought was a kidney stone. So yeah, it was a rough, rough, rough weekend. Yeah, so those of you on TikTok looking for pricing, I do have a video, all the parts, everything listed on my TikTok profile. How about you, gamer? How was yours? So, uh, Frankie, I think you can use... I mean, what I would do is I would go to Steam and pull up American Truck Simulator and just check out the requirements or the specs. I'm not exactly sure what they are. But even with an affordable PC with low specs, I'm sure you could just dial down the quality in the game. I keep everything on Ultra, but you can dial it down to, you know whatever the other options are. Oh, I didn't know you did uh, League Racing Gamer. One of my coaches for iRacing was into that. I think he was part of that Ford, Fordzilla team. Have you ever heard of them? I'm not sure, Southern. I never drove a truck like this before, so I really can't tell you how it is compared to an actual truck like this. I mean, I can tell you that, you know, it's pretty immersive. You kind of feel like you're driving in general. And then when I, you know, race in here, you can feel the difference between racing and driving. Where is the vehicle inspection? Right here. If I crash, I will build up damage in the form of a percentage. That's about it. Forty-eight thousand eight hundred and sixteen pounds. And if you want to see what a crash looks like, it's top of my TikTok page. And I posted a video, I don't know, just a day or two ago. I think it's labeled Jake Break and Crash. And you can see what happens. I have to get off an exit. There's some type of detour. All right, I guess I'll follow the rules here. Actually, you know what? I think I have room. I'm going to go around this. Now, no big explosion. There's no damage model in this uh, game. Shoot, I don't know if I have enough room right here. And you'll see what happens here when I hit this cop car. Nope, it should be good. But if I did hit him, I would just get a fine.
two-hour race. I've never done that before, gamer. I've always participated in, you know, the 20, 30 minutes, Skip Barber, and the, um, I forget what they were called in iRacing. But yeah, they were about 20, 30 minutes. Put it this way, I never had a pit, change tires, fuel. I never got that far. JB Motorsports, this is uh, John Ruda's Peterbilt 362 cab over with a Cat C16 for an engine. American Truck Simulator, and it is multiplayer if you run convoys or join a convoy. I don't know, uh, Jay Morales. I don't do this for money or income, just a hobby. So in my particular case, no. I would not make more than a trucker. I didn't know that, right? I've got four, Zach. No kidding, Brett. I didn't know that. Stop pretty quick. Chad, did you hear that? That truckers, you can get paid for doing this in real life? Did everybody know that? I didn't. I, I have, Darth. Actually, my first experience with this was Euro Truck Simulator, not American, and the reason was back then, Euro had a free trial to test out the game. American didn't. And then once I play that, I eventually pick this up. One day, gamer. I do have to get back into racing one day. I've got to find the time for it somehow. I used to do that at night. That was always a nighttime thing for me. What states do you get with the base game? What do you get? California, Arizona, Nevada. Brick Wall, you always tell me the answer to that. What's the included states? In New Mexico, right? California, New Mexico, Arizona, and Nevada, I think. said playing games having fun are you guys watching him all day playing games i don't think any of it is sad user 62 uh, what's ironic about your comment is you're here also and very likely scrolling from live to live harassing creators for you know no reason whatsoever i would say that's the saddest of the three options 
Just my opinion, though. You do, Nathan. There's force feedback in the wheel. I also have a seat mover, but I keep that off when I drive. I only use that for flight, so you would feel all the feedback in that as well. And you can actually see the seat mover in my latest video on TikTok when I do um, crash. Turn right. I do, Matt. I am on Twitch and then I upload these videos to YouTube. Uh, see, don't, don't focus on the price of my rig. You can get into this hobby for a lot less. You don't need all, you don't have to spend all that money to build one of these. You can buy a nice Logitech wheel and pedal set, bolt it to your desk, and you're good to go. So two to four hundred dollars if you buy the shifter, and you can play this game and really any other game out there, both sim games and arcade style. And if you like the hobby, yeah, you can take it from there. Buy a cockpit, a wheel stand. There's so many options. They even have lawn chair style cockpits that fold up when you're done with them. And I'm pretty sure you can fold them up with the wheelbase and pedals attached to them. All right, Chad, we are at our destination. I mean, people even build um, these cockpits out of PVC. You can use like two or three inch PVC pipe and build one, paint them, and they look pretty good. Hop on Reddit, look up PVC Racing Sim, and you'll find a bunch of them. You might even find plans for them. So, I mean, what does PVC go for? To build something like this? I would say not much. Alright, let's get this backed in. Give me a second chat. It's hard to read the chat and get this backed in. First, I got to figure out where it's going. Oh, wrong way. I actually have to completely turn around now. Oh. Let's see if we can go around all of this and straighten out. So TikTok, if you could, as I'm getting this backed in, I'd appreciate some likes and shares. I'd appreciate it if you follow my mod Bree. I'm 
going to try to grab a second job out of here. I don't have too much time to stream today, but I'll see if there's something quick. What side is this going on? That side? Hopefully I'm putting this on the right side, I'm not even sure. Nope, wrong side. Don't worry if this takes too long, I'll just drop it anywhere once I get close enough. Where did I get the setup from? All parts are listed in that video I posted on TikTok a few days ago. My chassis is from a company called SimLab. The name of it is a P1X. Anything wheel related is from Fanatec. My pedals are from Husenbeld. And then the rest is really just a computer with uh, displays. All right, I think we are good. So this thing we're dropping off is called a knuckle boom loader. I haven't a clue what it does, but I have, I'm guessing it has something to do with the logging industry, I guess. It is, it's a cab over, 362 cab over. Engine is a cat ah, C16. All right, I think we're straight enough. Maybe I should not have to pull up anymore. Yep, we're good. So it's super crooked, but they took it, so. All right, let me see if there's anything else out of here real quick. Time to get the job done. All right, chat, give me a second to get this loaded up. Take a minute or two, and then we'll be on our way. You can, Sean. And the only thing that happens when you crash is you build up damage in the form of a percentage, and the closer you get to 100%, you eventually have to stop for repairs. It's pretty straightforward. So the FOV in my virtual mirrors is like terrible. I don't know if you all can see them in the top left and right, but my left one indicates I should be going to the left, and the one on the right is kind of pointing me to the right. I actually do have the FOV mod. I just put it in. Whoops. I just installed it last week, and to be honest, I don't know if it made things better or worse. But I did make some changes to my config file related to the FOV prior to that, so who knows? It could be related to that. I should probably roll those back at some point. 
What's up, band man? How's it going? But I do see people on YouTube, you know, they love it. I just didn't notice much of a difference, so I don't know. So where are we going now? We're going back to Houston. We're dropping this off at Union Pacific in Houston, and it'll take about 10 minutes. And you can see all the feedback on these dirt roads in a wheel. Kenworth W900 Highway Killer is a lot more popular with the stream. Just wanted to drive something different today. Oh no, don't do that. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. I don't know how I just didn't get hit. That was surprising. seen one of these before and you want to see a really crazy setup hop on YouTube look up boosted media I mean if you think this is impressive his is completely different it's the same but different What's up, Kentucky Dad? How you doing? truck like this? No. Just a car. A car. A big um, box truck when I was younger, but nothing like this. Again, I don't do this for a living. I have a job, have a career. Just a hobby. That's it. Now, if anybody's on Long Island in New York and you want to let me drive your truck, let me know. I'd love to. set up a stream, we'll stream from your truck. You know what I just discovered is a crazy hobby too, speaking of hobbies. I just bought my wife, um, espresso machine. I started doing research on them. I cannot believe, I cannot believe it, how serious some people take it. So yeah, people really get involved in their hobbies. Name of the game, American Truck Simulator. Download on Steam, PC only.
My triples are 32 inch curved and my fourth up top is a 34 also curved and they're all 1440. So my triples are Ben Q and my fourth is a Samsung Odyssey G5. You don't really pick up lot lizards. I mean, you could. I got my girl with me. Sometimes I take my dog, but that's pretty much it. bothersome in a stream otherwise I've only got like five minutes left for this job and then I'm pretty much done for today so Nathan, the one I heard for Xbox is called On the Road. And I've never heard good things about it from Xbox users.
yeah, you've got jake brake, I mean, all sorts of stuff in this. It is American Truck Simulator. This is a cat C16 in this one. They list it as a thousand horsepower. It doesn't feel like it relative to the Detroit Diesel 60 that I have in the Kenworth. That's about five or six hundred. what I had in here before Kentucky dad I switched it the other day I think I did I know I had a DD60 in this one too at some point uh, which way should we go this way I guess all right chat I'm gonna get this one backed in I would appreciate some final likes and shares on TikTok. I'd appreciate it if you follow my mod Vree. Once I'm done with the stream, I'll pull the camera back so you can see the full rig on TikTok, which you can't see. And then, um, that's it. Give me a second. It's hard to read the chat when I'm backing these in. I might come back tonight for some flight. I say that all the time and I never do. But I might actually do it tonight. We'll see. Uh, those of you asking the game, you can download it on Steam. I think it was the first time I'm backing in in the rain. Not that it really makes a difference, but. All right, I think we did this with no pull-ups at all. We did, we're done. All right, Twitch, I'm out. Gamer, I'll check your message after. Anybody else on Twitch, I'm going to end the stream in a minute. That's it. Drop this. And TikTok, just give me a second. I'll get the camera pulled back. 